I'm here with uh, Ganesh Anakar, a student of Anand College, who has uh, just recently been felicitated with a number of awards, uh, international awards, and uh, high uh, So, can you tell us a bit about uh, the awards uh, that you have won, especially about the uh, first award that you won for the ICF Grand Award? Yeah, I won the first place at the ICF Grand Award, and then I won three other special awards, uh, one from the China Association for New Innovations, and then another from the Symantec Computing and another award from another company. So all the giving was worth $8,000 and so... So this was for a particular project that you had done. Yeah. Can you explain a bit about yeah. it? Uh, I explained a computer system which is uh, designed for handicapped people. It's uh, called the wireless uh, computer controlling device for handicapped people and what it does is letting a person to operate a computer uh, using his head movements and uh, instead of using the keyboard and the mouse uh, it uses a special software interface to provide the uh, screen interface and then uh, using four head movements the user can control almost anything an ordinary person does with a computer. So can you tell us a bit about like the motivation behind creating such a product? I mean there are I mean, some people like for example like Alexander Graham Bell he created the telephone because of uh, his uh, mother and the daughter, so I mean, what was your motivation for creating such a yeah. product? Yeah, uh, actually uh, so many people got handicapped uh, due to the war which actually concluded recently yes. and in order to do something for them, in order to serve them, I just wanted to build up something for them and uh, using the ability I had, the thing I could do was letting them enable to the latest computer technology and so this is my approach. And uh, can you tell us a few people who might have helped you along this success? It's, yeah, obviously uh, the principals of our school and the college uh, and then the teacher in charge of uh, ICT society and then the institution of engineers Sri Lanka including all the uh, officials in charge there and then all the uh, sponsors from the Intel and everybody who helped me to uh, for my success I would like to give them a thank you. So, uh, if I, uh, if you want, if you have any, what are the words of encouragement that you have for future students who would like to follow in your footsteps? Yeah. What, what is the message that you want to give? Yeah, them? yeah. Uh, there's a, uh, actually, I strongly believe that uh, before you uh, reach a destination, first you should start. Mm -hmm. So it's just a matter of starting, no matter what's the level you start. So uh, after you start is something, you should uh, keep on and on thinking about how to improve it and. In Missing its quality, and uh, first of all, you have to start, and then it's just a matter of thinking about it and then doing it. Okay. So, uh, congratulations once again uh, for you. winning the award. And uh, let me, like, let's finish up this interview with uh, what your views are for your future. What are you hoping to do after this? Yeah. You want to finish your A levels, and then what? What are you hoping to do, say, in another five years time? Yeah, uh, I'm definitely targeting on going forward in the IT industry. I'm on, I'm, uh, so uh, I love to uh, create new products and to serve people and uh, to try to make this world a better place. Uh, and so that's my, what my goal. I want to make this world a better place through IT. So that's all. Right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks.